And we begin tonight with the latest from Project B in Minot. Staff at the shelter say they're working to continue serving the needs of the community as the organization faces an investigation into its finances. In the last couple months, Project B has been rocked with unexpected organizational blows. The most recent one was the mutual decision to transfer the Broadway Circle project to the city of Minot. The city council approving that decision at their meeting on Monday of this week. Project B board president Tarina Crook saying the staff and board members put their all into seeing the family shelter constructed and finished due to the revolving door of homelessness. Once we realized the reality of it, there would have been millions more dollars we would have had to raise to go to that project. That's not fair on the community members. Now, Crook says their main focus currently is to keep their warming center, shelter, drives, meals, shower program, and other resources open and available for people in need. They will be hosting a two-day open house next Friday the 16th and Saturday the 17th. Crook says the community's support has been extraordinary and they want to speak to people one-on-one -on -one about how their money and resources are used for staff and clients. We just got out done with crawling, you know. We had to figure out what was wrong, how, what processes should we have had in place or what were broken. And now we've figured out what those problem sets were and now we're fixing them. So now we're walking. She says some of the changes they've made include hiring with a nonprofit coach and getting the right mentors. Their open house is 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. on Friday and 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. on Saturday. Now, meanwhile, the Ward County Commissioners will be holding a special executive session this Tuesday the 13th to discuss ARPA reimbursements for Project B.